interesting because I think our, our facial expressions while sleeping would be <laughs> quite interesting as well. Yeah. Except for Brian's. Brian's awake when he's sleeping. <laughs> Sleep, time, sleepwalking sure. around. Yeah. Look at that. One little canine sticking over the lip. Too sweet. Uh, it always amazes me the spots leopards can find to snooze. And this tree she's in is by no means a big tree. It's probably, in circumference wise, as big as my two hands put together, or maybe a little bit bigger. But that branch she, she is, those branches, she's lying across multiple branches, are actually quite tiny. And I definitely think if that was Hasana up there, it would be quite a spectacular tumble. Now she is quite a lot more agile than her brother and that has a lot to do with the fact that she is quite a bit smaller. Oh, tired kitty. I think the thumb should add some pillows to its, to its repertoire of things it sells. Get a, a thumb pillow. Shungile could definitely use one, although she does make a good job with her paw. Let's go have a look what Hassan is up to. Now, these cloud, the cloud cover we've got at the moment is actually a bit of a blessing in disguise. Uh, so when we were watching the weather yesterday, it was supposed to be about 80 80 degrees Fahrenheit at the beginning of the safari. Has Hasana given us the slip? No. Now, there's a wonderful example of leopard camouflage. I mean, we're probably about 20 feet from him and you can barely, barely see him. There we go. You can just see that little white spot there. I think that's his, I think that's his tail or is that his tummy? It's his tummy. Now, he's obviously panting a lot more heavily than young Shongile because he is a glutton. Oh, sorry about the brakes. There's a bit of sand in them. Hello, fatty. You made yourself a nice grass mattress there. Quite springy. Oh, doing a bit of de-ticking. Now we see how many pepper ticks Steph and everyone else gets on bushwalk. Imagine how many pepper ticks could hide in that fur. He is going to be a very big boy, I think. 